It wasn't very long ago that the best diagnostic device you could buy at the drugstore was the traditional thermometer. Things have certainly changed. First, there were pregnancy kits and self-operated blood pressure monitors. Then came an array of products to help patients deal with the effects of diabetes. More recently, we have seen urinary tract infection tests, devices to measure alcohol consumption and marijuana use, a DNA-based stool test that screens for colorectal cancer, a rapid HIV kit that does not require sending a sample to the laboratory, not to mention more gentle thermometers that get pressed into the ear or against the temple. It's all part of a wide-ranging effort to control medical costs by pushing the responsibility for primary health care, particularly the testing, monitoring, and screening of chronic conditions and health risks, back into the hands of the consumer. And shoppers are responding. The home health care market was $90 billion in 2012, but will grow to $130 billion by 2017. A host of other tests and devices are in the works. Blood glucose meters, home hemoglobin A1C tests, fetal heart rate monitors, pregnancy BP monitors, and even a diagnostic device that allows patients to test themselves against allergens ranging from food and environmental to inhalants and animals. It is just a matter of time before all these diagnostics will be available at the shelf. You can also expect that the major drug chains and other retailers ranging from supermarkets to discounters will put them under their store brand umbrella. Many already are. When they do, consumers can expect to find the same great savings they find with store brands in other parts of the store as they shop for their family's everyday needs. As retailers increasingly become a one-stop healthcare store, not only for pharmaceuticals, but also for lifestyle and preventative healthcare, you will be able to weigh yourself, monitor yourself, and test yourself at home with high-quality store brands. This is Bill Brooks for Store Brands USA.